While Christopher Columbus statues are being taken down, this billboard behind me has been put up since the 4th of July. And so far, it's gotten a lot of people talking and a lot of driver heads turning. The billboard that you cannot miss, says Christopher Columbus, the first Italian American welcomes you to Connecticut. The owner behind it is Louis D'Amato. He owns dozens of Italian restaurants in the state. He believes this is his way of boosting business in the state, all while taking a stand for his ancestors. Many Christopher Columbus statues around the country have been taken down. D'Amato thinks they instead should be relocated. These statues probably should be put on eventually on private property. And, and then, uh, because if we don't do that, you know, I, I firmly believe that Columbus, the story of Columbus is going to disappear. His billboard at the same time has been met with a lot of controversy. When these guys put that billboard, it's just like uh, propaganda. Those with Unidad Latina and Acción argue the words on the billboard are indeed false. You know, saying that, you know, Christopher Columbus was the first, uh, you know, like uh, Italian-American. That's not true. You know, this guy came, he destroyed and he went back to he he went back to Spain, you know. So he did not even stay here, you know. Like he caused, but the the legacy is a is a legacy that more than 100 million people died. D'Amato telling Fox 61 he empathizes with the black community, but says he also has to stick up for his immigrant family. Louis D'Amato says he has no plans of taking down the billboard and plans to have it up for quite some time. And he also said the Italian-American heritage of New Haven plans on putting a message on the other side of the billboard. Reporting in Milford, Carmen Chow, Fox 61 News.